Paul Lawrence Dunbar's poetry is a great example of using small details to convey big messages. In his poetry, he intentionally uses non-standard English diction to portray the issues that he faced as a black man. This seemingly insignificant detail actually contains some of the most important concepts he is trying to purvey. However, he is not the only person to do so. There are many other examples of artists who, have, who use small details to convey messages or to prove points. One example is embedded in the photograph entitled Candlelight in Time. Candlelight in Time shows a black man and his steed. Both look neglected, hungry, and unhappy. The fact that the scene was chosen to be displayed as a photograph is very important. For much cheaper, the person who wanted the scene depicted could have had a colored portrait produced. The fact that a photograph was chosen to represent the scene clearly shows that it was meant to be portrayed in black and white and represent the subject in stark reality. The scene placement is also very significant. In the picture, the man is beside his horse. The fact that he is next to his horse shows that he is trying his hardest to support it, but is unsuccessful, judging by the horse and his own frail bodies. Like Dunbar in his poetry, the photographer attempted to use small details that make up the work to convey the message. Another example of small details telling a lot can be found in 50 Cent's song, Window Shopper. Window Shopper is a way for 50 Cent to show what his life and the life of an African American in, to in today's world is like. In the course of the song, he uses the names of other black people and referred to them as window shoppers. The fact that he is using multiple black names and calling them window shoppers may mean that he is trying to make a point of how all people today have to win black people today have to window shop when they want something because it is otherwise unaffordable to them. The way he calls black people window shoppers may be making an even bigger statement that black people, in general, don't prosper in today's society. 50 Cent said, I don't cruise to nobody's hood without my gun. The point that he needs to have a gun just for inter-neighborhood travel shows the difficult lifestyle that he and other African American people had to deal with. Also. The intentional use of non-standard diction may have been used to display how there are still problems in education among black people in today's society. Like Dunbar in his poetry, one can see how 50 Cent hides his messages in the music in the tiniest details. 